Hi there, I'm Bobby Joe from Port Swing Your Insomniacs, and I'm going to be showing you how to sew on your Yoda ear. Okay, so I've got one on already. Basically, once you've got your regular two cat, you put it on, and you look in the mirror to see where you want your ears to be. I generally like mine right over my ear, right between the rim and where the increases start. Okay, so you put it on, you go, okay, there's one ear, the other one should be over here. Great, let's put the other one there. Which tends to be pretty much the other side of the hat. Okay, so your ear is basically like a triangle that's had some increases and decreases. That makes it the curvy, roundy kind of shape. And if you've made it um, stock in a stitch then the sides naturally roll in which is what you want for this ear. You're gonna put it on the side there and what we're gonna do is take the take the sides and just pull them in a little tiny bit and up two stitches so in and up. So if you do that it gives it a little pucker here. Okay fold it over and up a couple of stitches. Same with this one, in and up, almost to the middle. Not quite, maybe leave a tiny bit of space in between, it's up to you, but that gives it a nice curve. Place that there, stitch it on. I like to stitch all those two spots first where they're connected, all the way around the front, then all the way around the back. The last thing I do is take this strand here and sew it through here on the inside. Once you do that, you give it a pull and your ear will pucker in to make it so that it actually stands up on the hat like this instead of drooping down like that. So see this side here already stands up and I've only pulled on the top one, not the bottom part. You can pull on the bottom part too and that will make it stronger to stay in. So I'm going to show you how to do that now. Well, the rest of the video is going to be me sewing on the ear. I use the same color thread that I, or the same yarn from the hat so it doesn't show up. Okay, so I've done my pinch. I'm sewing that in right now. Let's see, one stitch. Leave a little end to weave in after. And then I'm going to just tie that right now. 